Hey curl friends and welcome back. So in today's tutorial I'm going to show you guys how to create these cornrows into double buns natural hair protective style. So I'm starting off on stretched hair of course. I went ahead and did a twist out with my product that is coming out soon. Don't worry guys. I'm using this Caravada oil to minimize as much frizz as possible before I begin to take down my twists. This step is totally optional. You can create either a braid out, a twist out, or just leave your hair natural. I wanted more texture to my bun, so I like my hair to be a tad bit curly, have some body and volume to them. A twist out or braid out to begin with will be great for super short hair, that way you get a nice full bun. Grabbing a rat tail comb, I'm going to go ahead and start preparing my part. It's a super really short part guys. I'm pretty much just parting from my hairline to the crown of my head. I'm just making like a little swerve part because I want one of my braids to wrap around my hairline and the other braid will go straight backward. I decided to try out a, a different style. I'm going to use this edge control from ORS. It's the olive oil edge control. I just wanted to create a hairstyle that does not have much of a hold to it. That way I can transition throughout the week into other hairstyles and not be pretty much held down by one. But I was not really a fan of this edge control. It got really, really greasy super fast. So I just used it throughout my entire head instead of just on my actual edges because it wasn't holding down anything to be quite honest. I'm just going to go ahead and create some really, really rough braids just to get the pattern in place. And I'm using these goody hair elastics to hold everything in place. This is great for if you're doing this hairstyle on yourself. It will allow you to be able to get to your parts much more easier and create more of a sleek hairstyle versus ending up pulling hair from the other sections and ending up with a super messy braid. So this does not have to look super perfect. We're going to go back in and perfect the braids at the end. And now that my blueprint for my braids is pretty much laid out, I'm going to go back in and perfect them. So I'm pretty much just focusing this braid that is swerved on my hairline towards the hairline. This is going to protect my edges and not pull so much on my edges. I'm not going to have any tension whatsoever, so it's like the perfect natural hair protective style. Once I get to the back, I'm going to go ahead and use an elastic scrunchie, a goody hair elastic, to hold it in place and create that bun. And then I can go ahead and move on to the next section. As you guys can see, it's coming out a lot more better. It looks really, really nice and polished versus before. Keeping this hairstyle as a low tension hairstyle, I'm just going to use the same exact goody hair elastic and on that last wrap around, I'm going to go ahead and create that bun. I don't want a whole bunch of bobby pins and extra stuff on this hairstyle to make it uncomfortable and I ended up using some eco solid gel to lay down my edges because y'all that edge control just was not the business y'all. <laughs> so I hope you guys enjoyed this hairstyle. It's a really really quick and easy fix. I love you guys and I'll see you guys in the next tutorial. If you haven't already, go ahead and hit that subscribe button to become a girlfriend so that you don't miss any other uploads. And go ahead and check out these videos.